Whoo, whoo. Nice fish on. What's up YouTube? Top Tactic Fishing here. Welcome to another episode. We are here in New Jersey and we are doing something a little bit different today. We are not targeting carp and we are not targeting catfish. We are actually going to be targeting bass and whatever is in this creek. Um, so I'm in a very tricky spot to begin with. I'm on a bridge. There's a creek right in front of me here. As you can see, it looks very, uh, very weedy, mossy, a lot of vegetation. Um, it's a good breeding ground for actually bowfin. And I have caught in bowfin here before. So I do have one video um, showing you that. As you can look in the description above for that video. And there's also bass here. I've never caught in bass, but I have seen bass in here. And wherever the bowfin are gonna be, it's where the bass are gonna be, or vice versa. So, very similar fish in some ways. So we're gonna be using minnows for our bait. And I got about maybe eight minnows. And these are all live, so we're using live bait. Essentially what we're doing is we're just free lining these minnows um, just with a 2 watt hook and we're just going to be kind of sticking these right near the tail here or rather we can kind of hook it right through the nostril. Kind of like that. And this is the setup. This is all we're doing. So we're going to be trying to target bass and bowfin. And, but um, essentially what we're going to do is we're just going to kind of let this sit, cast it out, let the, let the minnow do its thing, and then have the bait runner on. Nothing crazy here with this. All right. Got to get our other rod out there. Having two rods really increases your chances of catching a fish, obviously. So we're going to try to get this one out there. Above it, essentially. All right. So we've had no takes on the live minnow, so I'm literally just cutting off the head and putting the body on there for cut bait. And we're just going to free line this out there just like that. Cut off the tail, that way it looks more like a chunk. Should still be good enough for some bowfin. Nice and bloody here. See what we got here. Oh yeah. Oh. 
this was right on the cut bait. Let me grab my net. See if it's a small one. Can't tell if it's a bass or what. Yep, I think this, I think this is a bowfin. I'm pretty sure this is a bowfin. Or is it a bass? I can't tell. Hold on. Nope, this is actually a bass. Yeah! Wow, this is right on a... Um, that's funny. On cut bait. Interesting. I thought it was a bowfin at first. Excuse me there. Just saw the line going slack and catching bass. There he is. It's maybe like uh, close to a half a pound, if that. Probably not even that. All right. I'm gonna go ahead and release this guy now. There he goes. So, first time ever catching a bass on cut bait. We're getting another fish on. Oh, it's a nice one. Yeah, it's a nice one. I think this might be a bowfin. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, bowfin on. Hopefully this does not come off. Yep. That was running the live bait too. This one's running. Woo! Woo! Nice fish on. And now we're using now the live minnows are really coming in handy here. Come back here, little buddy. It's a long one. Jeez Louise. Got him. All right. Look at that though. Nice bowfin. This is right on the uh oh whoa 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 whoa. This is right on the live minnow here. And we're targeting this specific area right here. And this one has teeth, so we'll have to be careful. Alright, we're gonna go ahead and release this bowfin. We're gonna go right over here. All right, there he goes. All right, guys, we're gonna call it quits for the day. Uh, did something a lot different than I normally do. Freelining minnows. Uh, 
for a fish and we for unique fish that is this is a very unique spot to catch fish that you normally would never catch um, that's why i love creek fishing um, we caught a bowfin as you know these are more of a rare kind of fish to catch i mean they are around but they're not common like some of the other freshwater fish are like bass and sunnies and catfish and carp that kind of thing so you really kind of have to figure out where they are and appreciate you watching this video give a thumbs up like subscribe if you haven't and we'll see you next time on top tactic fishing take care guys